To maintain your Hyperflow filter's peak performance, we recommend back flushing about every 8 liters. That's pretty frequent, but good maintenance will extend the lifespan of your filter and keep it pumping fast. It's easy to do, and after a few times, it shouldn't take any more than a minute or so. Before you start, find a place away from moving water so you don't lose any parts if you drop something. All you'll need is your Hyperflow and about half a liter of filtered water. First, remove the inlet hose and set that aside. Unscrew the inlet and you'll find a large black check valve facing up. Pull it out, flip it over, and place it back in, making sure it's properly seated. It should drop into place nice and easy. Next, extend the piston all the way and slowly twist it while gently pulling out. You'll feel it set into place. Unscrew it with some gentle pressure to keep it engaged, and inside you'll find a small red check valve facing towards you. Pull it out, flip it over, and reset it. Again, make sure it's not jammed and screw it back together. Now compress the cylinder until it's flush with the bottom of the piston. This purges air that would otherwise airlock your filter. If you go too far, you'll expose this o-ring. Now screw the inlet back on and you're set to back flush. Next, connect your filter to whatever bottle or reservoir you're using and invert it so you're always pumping water. Extend the pump, allowing the chamber to fill completely before compressing each stroke. Feel free to use some gusto to really flush it clean. Pump at least one half liter of water to ensure proper cleaning of the filter media. To get back to square one, just reverse the whole assembly process. Reverse those check valves so they're both facing towards you and you're all set for another eight liters or so.